Hi, I'm Mike Lee of Team Horizon, and this is a Team Tech Tip bonus tip. You've just seen a Tech Tip video involving servo trim. No doubt you wonder just how fine the trim steps can still be and have the servo respond to it accurately. Well, if you've ever wanted to test the resolution of your servo to see how accurately that servo will re react to your command, especially on the trim steps, let me show you a simple test. First, find yourself a narrow or thin rod similar to what you saw us use in the video for the trim setup. Now attach the rod to the servo output arm. Do not use glue, it might mess up your servo. You need only to get the rod firmly attached. In this case, we attached it with a small length of solder. Now plug the servo into a receiver that's bound to your radio and make sure it's working. Begin adjusting the trim one click at a time to see if the servo responds to each click and we're going to show you that right now. Here we're going to go with the with the trim clicks one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and as you can see it responded to each and every click that's what a good servo does if it doesn't respond to each and every click you give or if it starts vibrating around in the middle uh, that means your servo is not very good on resolution and possibly has a problem at center some servos have a programmable dead band capability and this can be adjusted to increase the resolution of the servo. Doing this test is a great way to determine just how good your servo can perform. If you demand performance and quality from your servos, then you owe it to yourself to know how to test your servos for quality and performance. This is one of those tests that is quick and easy to do. For Team Horizon, I'm Mike Lee and you just got a bonus tip. Thanks for watching.